Kids are enjoying a day off with the MLK holiday, but they could, soon could see a change at school. Yeah, and that change is happening in the cafeteria. Sweeping new changes are being proposed to a school lunch policy that could see more pizzas and burgers end up on the menu. CBS 4's Natalie Brand reports. Proposed changes to the National School Lunch Program would affect meals served to 30 million school-aged children in 99,000 schools across America. Food service providers could dial back servings of fruit at breakfast, cut back on grains to make room for meats and meat alternatives, and relax current vegetable requirements. Agriculture Secretary Sonny Perdue says this is because kids are wasting food. The Department of Agriculture proposed these changes to put local school and summer food service operators in charge of their lunch programs because they know their children best. Secretary Perdue ate lunch with school kids after a previous change in food standards back in May of 2017. We're giving these, these professionals, these food service professionals, the flexibility to move as we get a healthier generation. That year, former First Lady Michelle Obama, who championed children's nutrition as one of her key causes, sounded off on those changes. You know, this is where you, you really have to look at motives. <laughs> you know, I mean, you have to stop and think, why don't you want our kids to have good food at school? What is wrong with you? The American Heart Association calls this latest proposal unnecessary, saying schools will now serve fewer fruits and grains, a smaller variety of vegetables, and less healthy entrees that aren't part of a balanced meal. The Agriculture Department plans to have an open comment period this month. Natalie Brand, CBS News, Washington.